Scotland, Scotia, Alba. Whatever you care to call it, it is undeniably breathtaking. This beautiful country is bursting with green spaces, lush forests and towering mountains overlooking vast lochs. And running through the heart of it are Scotland's rivers, who provide the source of life for everything around us. Water. Scotland receives the most annual rainfall in the UK with an average of 1500 millimetres a year and up to 3000 millimetres in the Western Highlands. This rainfall gathers in the lochs and rivers. The 11 major rivers pump this water through the lowlands and highlands, providing a fresh water haven for all species of plants and animals, including ourselves. Every major body of water and flowing river in Scotland now has been partly diverted by dams for use in hydropower or redirected to reservoir catchments for human consumption. Scotland now has 85% of the UK's hydroelectric energy resource, much of it developed in the 1950s by the North of Scotland Hydroelectric Board. The board played a large part in bringing power from the glens into Scottish homes. Hydropower supports clean development and is recognised as being fully renewable and sustainable. It is still one of the most inexpensive ways to generate power. The biggest change the world has seen in the last two centuries is the rise in population. Living amongst it, incredible and rare wildlife. Each of them are all connected and balanced through the fragile ecosystem built on complex connections and relationships. But these connections, competitive or collaborative, are becoming increasingly fragile. The industrialization of the modern world has led to man-made climate change, which through warmer and wetter weather patterns, is driving changes in the distribution and population level of species and reducing the resilience to other pressures, such as invasive non-species. Another consequence of this industrialization is an increasing disconnection between people and nature, meaning less people have nature in their daily lives and perhaps less inclined to care for our shared environment. This is my home, and this is your home. While we may have little to no control of the wider world, we do have control over the world around us and the choices we make. Climate change is too big to tackle alone. We can be planting wildflowers, trying to avoid products with single-use plastic and peat in them, and using the car less. These are just little ways you could benefit the ecosystem around you. Let's keep Scotland beautiful. Farewell to the Highlands. Farewell to the North. The birthplace of valour. The country of worth. Wherever I wander, Wherever I rove, the hills of the highlands, forever I love. My heart's in the highlands, my heart is not here. My heart's in the highlands, a chasing a deer. Chasing the wild deer and following the roe. My heart's in the highlands, wherever I go.